What do you see over there, huh? What do you see, girl? You know, one of the interesting characters of literature was Ernest Hemingway. Strangely, we met a fishing guy down in the Florida Keys who was very interesting and also looked just like Ernest Hemingway. If you're an angler looking to catch a surprise, well, there's a notion of them here, here on the flats. They're called the tidal flats. It's also where fishing guide Vaughn Cochran spends his days poling the clear, shallow salt water, just a mere cast from Key West, Florida. A day on the flats is like a float trip over a giant aquarium, and something, it seems, is always swimming by. When the water's this low and it's just coming in like this, you really are able to see the fish on this flat because their backs are out of the water just about. Ooh, I'm glad I didn't catch him. Holy cow. Huh? <laughs> Lemon. A lemon shark? Yeah, he's a hundred pounder. It's this magic act that for years has kept Vaughn Cochran polling the flats as a professional guide. This polling is basically control drifting. I mean, we're kind of going... His perch is a platform atop a flat skiff, a boat especially designed to skim over eight inches of water. My vantage point is uh, considerably better up here than what you have down there. Oh, there's a nice fish over here on the side on the left in that white spot. <laughs> there he goes. Watch, he's going to take off. I don't know what that is. It's not a, it's not a barracuda. No, it's not. It's either a shark. He's coming right by the boat to the right. Watch the rod tip. What's a shark? Cobia. Is it cobia? Yeah, you got a cobia. Great. <laughs> the fight was on and on and on. Moments later, my line tangled and the cobia was gone. What happened? I don't know. In short order, another tube lure was tied on. A strange lure if I ever saw one. And I don't know what it represents. Nobody's ever figured that out, but they really do like it. And it's all a barracuda needs. A tube lure that wants to get away. Third to the left, 11 o'clock. Hard. Okay, real fast. I'm gonna right in front of a barracuda. Real, 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 real. I got a barracuda, man. <laughs> I tell you, he's hit so fast you can't even see it. Armed with a mouthful of teeth, the long barracuda is an ominous sight on the end of a fishing line. And my guide's eyes soon spotted the prize fish of the flats, a permit. We hooked a live crab for bait and made a cast. Oh my God. Yeah, you got one. <laughs> oh man, he didn't know he's hooked. With an awesome display of power, the permit <laughs> peeled off 150 yards of line, maybe more. I don't have any idea where he is. At that point, the permit was swimming wherever and whenever it wanted. Just get back every inch that you can. Yeah. <laughs> oh, golly. I'm starting to win a little bit. All right, we're, we're at a standstill, so it's just you and him. <laughs> and finally, the beautiful fish had had enough. Oh, there he is. He's a beauty. Yep. I'll jump down and grab him by the tail. <laughs> Man, I'll tell you what. Is that a dandy? How about that? That's a dandy. The prize of the flats was ours, just for a picture. <laughs> one tired arm, one happy team. Okay, let's Ready, let it go. You release him. Okay. Come on, baby. So hold him by his tail now until yeah. he gets going. Yeah. Well, he wants to go. All right. Let, let him go. go. Yeah. All right. <laughs>